Splendent welcome sight, and stall the house greatest light. At your throne we raise our voice, says Mother of the Mountain Bride. At your throne. We raise our voices, Mother of the Mountain Bright. Birds of hear your gentle call, Mother Lady of the Soul. Home to Jesus, come my children, come to meet him, great and small. Come to Jesus, come my children, come to meet him, great and small. Birds of flight, all oh, bless your name. Morning doves to speak your fame. Bones is with chirping sparrow, sounding tones so tender, true. Branches fill with chirping sparrow, sounding tones so tender true. Join we now creation's choir, voicing all our hearts desire, blending with our mother's praises, purest lady, full of grace, blending with our mother's praises, purest lady, full of grace. Praise be Jesus Christ. Mama, you welcome us to your table so we can come to know you better. And you who know us so well can reveal to us the miraculous graces of your image at Transtohova the Black Madonna. We have set as a goal that all those listening call others to your table so that by the end of this nine short days, we can fill this table with delight of all your children and celebrate your great feast on Friday on the 26th of August, the feast of Our Lady at Transtohova. So today, we contemplate yet another aspect of your mysteries, your mystery and most miraculous image, your earth tone skin. You are our mother, given to us by Jesus himself from the height of his cross. When he said, woman, there is your son. Son, there is your mother. From that moment, the disciple took her into his home. Your earthly origin was Middle Eastern, a woman from Nazareth. Your skin color was therefore deep olive brown as on your Black Madonna icon. Ethiopian Christians recognize your origins and call you mother. 
Over 600 years ago, your advent to Poland as the Black Madonna saved us from armies who were attacking Christians. You came to us from the east through your sojourn in Ukraine. Poets and bards have described your complexion and that of your son as roasted wheat, a healthy brown burnished gold, a loaf of whole grain bread, or as dark as the earth herself. To us, Mama Mary, your color speaks of intimacy and closeness. As close as a loaf of bread or the soil we cultivate, plant in, even walk on, so close are you to our cares. This earth feeds us as your own breast fed your son. The earth gives birth to grain and grain to bread and bread to the holy communion of your son. This same earth supports us, supports our every step, rooting us securely and safely. We praise and honor the fruit of your womb growing from this earth as a human and divine Lord Jesus, who is our rock, our fortress, our deliverer. Every generation has called you blessed, and in blessing you, mother of the fruit of the earth, with our work, the work of human hands, we worship the bread of life, of heaven, and of angels in the Eucharist because consecrated bread is taken from the earth. We promise to honor all bread as a gift, all fruits of the earth as careful and non-wasteful stewards. Through your mother of God, we, pray, we pledge not to abuse, harm, or exploit this earth. In you, we reverence both the abundance of the soil and the farmers who till the soil. Show us respect for all food and never wasting it. Guide us to honor every laborer. Make our spirits, O Lord, a bond overflow with gratitude to the Father, our Creator, and our minds and hands labor tirelessly for just wages, sufficient rest, rights of families, and fair treatment of all who work for a living. Take us, Mama, to Joseph, patron of craftsmen and employees, and make his dedication inspire us to use all our energies, talents, and earth's resources for the good of others. Now as a meditation, we'll sing a song so appropriate to this one, to this table talk, oh mama. You're the breath of the springtime. Please sing together. You're the breath of the springtime all year round. Family cares, household chores filled your day. You brought God to the earth in a small town. Our valley of tears turned to do our new way. Mother, you understand all our yearnings. Your love strengthens us on our way. Mama, you've shown the best in us always. May we be good news every day. Thank mm -hmm. you.
people need understanding, acceptance, healing words, closing tears like a wound. We need hearts, open hands, trusting friendships. We need Jesus, let's bring him to others as you did. Mother, you understand all our yearnings. Your love strengthens us on our way. Mama, you see the best in us always. May we be good news every day. O Mother and Queen of Families, Intercede for us, pray for us, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. For those who till the soil, nurture and harvest its crops, and those who bring them to the market, for just remuneration and respect for their labors, we flee unto your protection, O Mother. Lead us to Jesus, answer us. For employers to respect laborers through fair wages, adequate vacation time, honoring their family times for worship and faith celebrations, we flee under your protection, O Mother. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. For believers not to support global corporations which exploit the earth's resources, and abuse human labor. We flee under your protection, O Mama. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. That pertinent people turn away from compulsive consumerism and purchase goods from local businesses and farms. We flee under your protection, O Mother. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. May farming families, their members, young and old, attribute their successes first to God, recognize that the Almighty as their source of all well-being. May they praise God in daily prayer, Sunday worship, wisely utilizing the energies of families, employees, and all technology. We flee under your protection, O Mother. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. For world leaders to ensure a just sharing of the earth's goods, resources, and technology to countless suffering from famine, displacement, and displacement of war, particularly in Ukraine, we flee under your protection, O Mother. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. As the heavenly household of saints urges us, may we be good bread for those who hunger for understanding, meaning, and all bread be communion for those who seek authentic love. We flee under your protection, O Mama. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. Carefield Mother, please grant me the courage to honor you in my home. Help me make a permanent niche as a contact, a heaven door, a place of calm and refuge for my family. We flee under your protection, O Mama. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. Loving Mama create as well as similar, similar secret place in my heart, where I may always find Jesus, your Son, no matter where I am. We flee under your protection, O Mama. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. I vow to spread your loving devotion, to pray your son's rosary mysteries with the youngest I know. Get to know him better by spreading his gospel regularly, and so recognize him in the needy person who interrupts me and my plans. 
We flee under your protection, O Mama. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. Loving Queen, please help me witness to the aimless wanderer, the seeker, that the Lord has done great things for me and holy is his name. Inspire me for this mission. We flee under your protection, O Mother. Lead us to Jesus. Answer us. And now you join your own petitions, your own petitions, your needs, the needs of your heart, the world, your family, those you know, those you love, those who are ill, those who seek healing. All those are embraced by you, O Mother, who are the healing, the health of your people. Salus Populi Romani, as is pra proclaimed by the people in Italy, health and salvation of your people. The Roman people say that. Let us also say that before you this evening. And we say that in the most ancient words in the oldest prayer that was written just after the apostles finished writing the Gospels. Under your protection, under your protection. Under your protection, we seek refuge. Holy Mother of God, despise not our petitions in our needs, but from all dangers, rescue us always. Virgin most glorious, Virgin blessed, O Lady, O Lady, our intercessor, our mediator, and our lasting comfort. Unite us, present us, and always lead us to your divine Son, O Lady, O Lady, our intercessor, our mediator, and our lasting comfort. Some of you have asked why there's a purple little schnick or protection towel over you. That has been on there since the beginning of Lent and since the end of February, I believe the 24th, uh, which, which we are calling all the world to penance and to do penance and pray for Ukraine. The sorrowful purple prayer towel reminds me and you now this evening and each evening to pray and gather the families who have been uh, exiled from their homes and thrown out of homes which were destroyed, uh, some to Poland and other countries. O oh, Mama, Mama Mary, gather them together so they can come home when there is peace, peace which only God can give. Gather them together. We pray to you, our mother, who understands our needs. Now we sing your prayer. We close this evening like the church closes every evening with your words of praise to God. The Magnificat, straight from sacred scripture. Your words close each day of the church's day. Your words of praise. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. He has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has given the strength of his arm. 
He has cast them of might from their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning is now, and will be forever. Amen. We'll be looking for the mailbox tomorrow to see if anybody sent in any special prayers because we're already on our fifth day of this table talk with you, Mama. I know you're waiting. You're waiting just to hear those prayers. You're waiting to see that your children come to you, come to you with their needs. Not just think of them in their heads, but come to you and take a seat at your table because that is where you wait for us so you can introduce us to the Lord of that table, Jesus Christ. So if you need to send your handwritten intentions, that is to St. Casimir Church, 160 Cable Street, Buffalo, New York, 14206. All that information is found on Facebook here earlier. So we come to the end of the most beloved song, the song which moves our hearts, stirs our hearts to love you even greater, the Black Madonna song. I hope you enjoyed yesterday the bells from, from Częstochowa, Jasna Góra in Poland, uh, they rang for us because at 9 o'clock every, every day in Poland, uh, a roll call is taken to see who's at her table, who's at Mama, who's at your table, Mama. Uh, and so we joined with Poland, even this evening, with the joyous sounds of those powerful bells ringing out both freedom, love, and calling all your children to your table the Black Madonna song. God, he's Celestine, Eva, all those. Blessed Madonna, O Lady of Heaven's grace, allow me, O Black Madonna,
Madonna to fall in to your embrace. Embrace Jeannie, Father David, Karen, Diane, Annie. All those watching. Madonna, blessed Madonna, O Lady of Heaven's grace, allow me, O Black Madonna, to fall. Disturbance, where shall we find refuge safe? Where to go for reassurance without children finding grace? Just remember, O oh Madonna. Fix your eyes on our needs. Be attentive to the chanting of our pleas. As Marianne joins us to pray. Mana, blessed Madonna. O Lady of Heaven's grace, allow me, O Black Madonna, to fall in to your embrace.
grace be Jesus Christ.